Hey, I'm Tom White, sports editor for StreamSemester.com and digital media teacher at the Morgan County College and Career Academy in Madison, Georgia. And today, very special unboxing, obviously not uh, in a classroom where I typically do these um, for obvious reasons. This is my um, son's old bedroom that I have since converted into a office slash studio space, including my shoes from when I was a baby. Um, a couple weeks ago, Blackmagic Design announced the ATEM Mini Pro and um, really excited about it. Really, um, really excited about what it can do for educators. I think that um, if you're new to streaming, it's a very good tool. I wrote that the ATEM Mini was a great tool. Um, this is even greater. So uh, pretty excited about it. Uh, I want to start by saying Blackmagic doesn't pay me. I don't get to keep this. Um, they send it to me to review and play with and see what I see what I like about it. So um, the only thing I've done is take it out of the Amazon package. I did that in the garage and take the plastic off, though, as you can see, it's still perfect, shiny and new, even in the package. So um, my black magic welcome. And uh, they usually, yeah, give you the update on how to get your ATEM software. A Blackmagic sticker. Um, I don't have one of these, so they won't be getting that back. Uh, eight, uh, software installer information and um, DaVinci Resolve 16. If you aren't, uh, if you're in a situation where you need um, cost effective, high quality um, video editing software, definitely check out DaVinci. Um, it's really rad. Uh, so now to the actual unboxing 12 volt power. And obviously a multitude of power options there. Grab the US version. And the bell of the ball here would be the ATEM Mini Pro. Um, if you're not familiar with the ATEM Mini, four input switcher, they're all HDMI inputs. Um, very simple control panel. You have your switcher buttons here. This is actually audio, so you can turn your audio on and off. You can do auto follow, auto follow video, and you can adjust your levels for your four HDMI inputs there. You also have two mic inputs here, and you can turn them on and off, volume up and down. And then over here are your picture-in-picture -picture options, um, on, off, and then your four corners. I will use that a good bit um, for some interviews I'm doing and some teaching that I'll be doing um, over the next several weeks while I have this. You have your um, your transition duration buttons here, um, your transition effects here. Um, and then this is, this is the new stuff. This area right here is the new stuff that's pretty exciting. Video out. It used to be that you had to go into the ATEM control, our software controls, and change your output on the HDMI out. And you really had preview, you had program, and that was pretty much it. Well, now with this, you can do it A on the faceplate. B, you can punch in, including a new multi-view, which I will show in my full review later. The other additions are record and stream. Without getting too technical, the streaming portion is phenomenal from what I've seen and read so far. Um, it is a hardware solution to encode your video. So um, if you're using a, a software switcher, or really any software encoder, there's a little bit of compression there that, that can change things. Um, you're gonna be able to get a better video signal out with this, just know that. Um, you can control all of that here, and we'll get into a lot of that. Um, on the back plate here, your mic's in, your four HDMI in, your HDMI out, your USB out, uh, that's USB-C, so that you can control your uh, software with it. You can also, um, now record straight out of that and we'll talk about that at length too and then your um, ethernet jack that you use for software control and for streaming now so really excited about that and we'll get into a lot of that as i break down the actual review um, i'm going to put this thing to the test i have my gopro i have um, a sony px70 camera i have a black magic pocket cinema camera and i'm going to put them all in there together i'm also going to take um, a video feed from my computer 
for my graphics and see if it'll actually do what it says. I'm going to see if it will actually scale everything correctly. I'm going to see if I can control all of the audio correctly, see if there's any, any differences in the audio between the different inputs, as well as take the audio from my mixer that I use and run that in as an input and, and control that as well. So I, uh, I am going to do my best to put this thing to the test and see um, what, what it will do. But ultimately, got to say, really excited about having this for the next little while before I send it back again. BMD doesn't pay me. They don't, I don't get to keep the equipment. Um, we have a good relationship. Um, I've worked with their equipment for years. I have written for them for years and done reviews for years. Uh, I'm really excited about this one. I think that for educators, for less than $600, you can have this. And you see how big it is. Um, I've eaten sandwiches bigger. That's what I said about the ATM Mini, but the ATM Mini Pro is even bigger in terms of what it will do in the same um, in the same frame. So uh, really excited about it. Please make sure that you follow us um, on streamsemester.com and on our social media sites to really get uh, a glimpse of what we're going to do and what I can do with this, especially as I'm working from my home studio. I'm teaching and I'm hosting podcasts and I'm doing all those things. Really excited about what I'm going to do with that. I'm going to hopefully take uh, my podcasts to a different level. So uh, thank you for watching this. And if you need more information, go to streamsemester.com or blackmagicdesign.com. Have a great day.